select file open and I'm going to browse for a file that I want to open this photo. And you'll notice with the photo I select, there's a lot of wasted area around the photo and I want to crop that away using the crop tool. And the crop tool is on the left hand side. You click on it and then you click and hold down on the image the area you want to keep. And so I'm going to click and make an area here around the skull. Now I've cut off a bit of the skull, so I'm going to move the box over till it's only taking the skull. And I'm also going to enlarge it slightly so it's a little narrow. It's using the handle on the right hand side. When I'm ready, I click, click enter and that will then crop the image. Now I want to save it in a format that all programs can see, so I'll click file, save as and then I'll change the name to a new name because I don't want to write over the file in case I want to you know, make a mistake and I'll type skull cropped and I'm going to change it to a JPEG type image file. This can be seen by all program then click save. Now you also get the option to vary the quality. The larger the file the better the quality of the image the lower the worse but you can go down to about four and still get a really good image. Uh, it also shows you how long it will take to download if you put it on a web page. Then you click OK. And that's all there is. So opening, cropping and saving an image as a, a file that all programs can see.